July 3, 2014, Feast of St. Thomas, Apostle. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Ephesians. Brothers and sisters, you are no longer strangers and sojourners, but you are fellow citizens with the Holy Ones and members of the household of God, built upon the foundation of the apostles and prophets, with Christ Jesus himself as the capstone. Through him, the whole structure is held together and grows into a temple sacred in the Lord. In him you also are being built together into a dwelling place of God in the Spirit. The Word of the Lord Responsorial Psalm The response is, Go out to all the world and tell the good news. Praise the Lord, all you nations. Glorify him, all you peoples. Go out to all the world and tell the good news. For steadfast is his kindness for us, and the fidelity of the Lord endures forever. Go out to all the world and tell the good news. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Thomas, called Didymus, one of the twelve, was not with them when Jesus came. So the other disciples said to him, We have seen the Lord. But Thomas said to them, Unless I see the mark of the nails in his hands, and put my finger into the nail marks, and put my hand into his side, I will not believe. Now a week later his disciples were again inside, and Thomas was with them. Jesus came, although the doors were locked, and stood in their midst and said, Peace be with you. Then he said to Thomas, Put your finger here and see my hands, and bring your hand and put it into my side, and do not be unbelieving, but believe. Thomas answered and said to him, My Lord and my God. Jesus said to him, Have you come to believe because you have seen me? Blessed are those who have not seen and have believed. The Gospel of the Lord.